Hunt-Doomers, Jeff here. Hey, I thought I'd put a little short video together for you folks who are interested in my one pin bracket. Basically on this design, you'll notice that all the arms stay parallel with each other. And the big thing when I started on figuring this out how to do it, you had to make sure that you have drive shaft clearance where it comes through the opening here for each attachment that you plan on using. Now, these were three quarter inch bolts, three inches long, that I went through the draw bar with. A lot of my projects here are made from whatever I have laying around in my heart pile upstairs for steel. Uh, in regards to these pieces here, these are two inch wide and half inch thick. Now, I only had some shorter pieces, so actually they're splay straight here. And I just kind of ground them to make it look like it wasn't. And then actually this piece here was long enough for I put a bend on each end to give it a little more spice. Now technically you can use uh, rectangular tubing or anything, you don't have to get fancy, put this 45 on. I just do it to give it a little more of the store-bought look. The majority of my attachments have a channel that sits between these two bolts and a little bit of gap, maybe eighth or quarter on each side. The bagger actually sits in here like a fork where it's mounted so much further off than this. The upper brackets here, uh, them are also two inch and by quarter inch thick. Got holes in them, three quarter inch. Eleven and three eighths to the top. I'm going to do the inside dimension on this one for you. 20 and 3 quarter, and add another inch, and then on the outside. And a first hole here, we're at 1 and 5 eighths. Second one, we're going to be 4 and a half, and to the very top, a tad over 5 and a half inches. 1 and 3 quarter ID on them. Here's a look at the ease of use with several attachments. Hey, tubers was a race against the sun, and I beat it. Anyway, I'll be uh, getting some more attachment videos together as time permits. And thank you so much for stopping by. Catch you back here again. Bye-bye.